Admittedly, motor tricycles, popularly known as Pragya in the Tichima municipality, have helped in the provision of employment to a number of young people and a source of wealth creation, not to mention its ready getaway means of transportation. However, with the statistics available to city authorities on crime and indiscipline, especially in the night, the Tichiman Traditional Council, together with the police administration, has placed a ban on the use of these tricycles beyond 10 p.m. The move, according to the Registrar of the Traditional Council, Evans Egan, is to help minimize crime rate across the municipality, especially at night. In one of our security meetings, uh, it got to light that um, there has been increase in Pragya theft, the motor itself, and secondly, um, people who patronize Pragya, being the passengers, mostly they are being attacked while on board um, these tricycles. So in order to keep this um, menace in the Techiman um, traditional area, Nananim decided that um, we should um, restrict their operations. So the traditional council, that's the standing committee, uh, is the highest decision body for Techiman traditional council, made a decision that the Pragya uh, operators are not going to operate beyond 10 p.m. He noted that the decision is for the safety of the riders and the passengers as a whole and appealed to them to comply. Our main focus is to protect people who patronize Pragya and also protect the owners of this Pragya cycle. Because in the end, uh, they are vulnerable at night that they can, I mean, rob the, the motorcycle and at the same time harm the drivers. So we are pleading with the operators, especially the drivers that these restrictions are there for their own sake or for their own safety, not to punish them. This decision, though taken together with the leadership of the Pragya Riders Association, is currently having a toll on their businesses. Chairman of the association, Awal Mohammed, says the situation is not only affecting these riders but passengers as well. Some are also make, talking about timing for closing and other things. Yes, it has also been out there that we need to close at 10. Right. We are in talk with the uh, authorities so that we we'll look at how to solve keep that because currently many of them are, so, are, are complaining about the timing, uh, the closing time and other things. Because they are not making their sales, they are not making their this and other uh, this, uh, customers who are stranded after 10 o'clock going. They can't get means because taxi is not plowing and so they cannot get means to their place. Other people travel and come in the night, they want means to go home. They are not getting it because Pragya is not working after 10 in Tejiman. Awal Mohammed is however calling on the security agencies to work towards improving on their patrols across the municipality and further appealed that the 10 p.m. closing time be extended to 12 a.m. each day. I'll call on the security agencies to uh, at least step up their security uh, operations. I think it's, it's, it's to be logical that we should close at 12. So by that time, you know, many people would have maybe gone to their houses. By that time, I believe no rider will be able to come and stand before me and tell him that, Chairman, uh, the 10 o'clock is affecting me. I'm not going to make my sales. But I think that it will help us a lot. Reporting for Joy News, Anas Sabit, Tichiman.